Haunted attractions are getting ready to open for the Halloween season later this month. Their safety plans have been submitted and approved by health officials. Fox 59's Kayla Sullivan shows us how the ongoing pandemic could affect that spooky experience. The goal of every haunted house is to scare customers, but this year owners have a unique challenge of making customers also feel safe here, at least from COVID-19. We want them to come here and have fun. Hannah Haunted Acres is working to provide a safe environment to be scared in. Hand sanitation stations at the entrance to all of our lines, at the beginning of our all of our attractions, at the exit of all of our attractions. He says being mostly outdoors on a 78 acre farm makes social distancing easier, but hiring employees has been a challenge. We normally have a whole lot of applicants. We have a good amount of applicants, but we can always use more. Indy Scream Park is seeing a similar dip in interested scarers. Both attractions plan to require masks for workers. We've actually changed how their makeup is done, where they will wear masks like this, that kind of do the, uh, the character face on the lower half. So we have them for the different houses that we have. So like clown houses have their own. As for customers, that depends on whether the governor lifts the statewide mandate at the end of the month allow our customers to make their own decision. My thinking is we would keep the masks in place because we built our entire entire park around it. Um, if it gets lifted, um, I think that's one of those things we'll play by ear. Both are expecting sold out crowds despite the pandemic. I think people are excited to get out and go have fun. People are out. They're wearing masks, they're being safe, but they're out. To avoid standing in unnecessary lines, these attractions are encouraging people to buy their tickets online this season. Reporting in Indianapolis, Kayla Sullivan, Fox 59 News.